The Complex Care Program was established in 2021 and it was something that we had wanted to do for a long, long time because there are a number of kids here at Grandview that have multiple complexities, both with developmental issues and also with physical issues and require a lot of extra care. And this is a lot more than even most of the kids that come to Grandview, that the kids really need a, a large number of physicians, they have a large number of therapists, and we felt the best way for this to happen would be all under one roof close to home. SickKids brings the other side of the picture of the medical care to the partnership. So while we see them locally, while they're well and they're out of hospital, because of their medical needs, when these children need hospitalization, they'll be hospitalized the majority of the time at SickKids. And so there's a way that we coordinate the care. So when they are admitted to SickKids, um, I'm also a physician at SickKids and I will get some information that they've been admitted. And there's the other half of the program that exists there. We'll see them every day when they're in hospital. And then when they go home from hospital, we'll coordinate their needs back at home as well so that there's that constant loop of communication. The Complex Care Clinic in Grandview has actually helped my family by being able to reach out to them when needed. It helps me be able to get my whole team, even like Grandview, sick kids, like his pediatrician, family doctors, that they can all get together and know, hey, this is going on, and if we need to reach out to the school, then it's really easy to be able to reach out to the school. My role starts before the appointment. Um, I call them first and I speak to them and um, ask them questions about what's going on in the family, if they have any major concerns that they would want to discuss with the complex care team and the team comprises of so many clinicians and a nurse practitioner and a pediatrician and a dietitian. So if they have any specific question for a specific team member, I write that down and share it in advance so the team comes prepared at the appointment. We need the program in Durham because we don't have to travel all the way to sick kids. I was traveling almost once a month to there for complex care and other appointments and it gets costly. So like I was traveling by train, bus, and then I got my car. But that's costly right there and that's a pointless appointment there where we can just come here and have our appointment here. I think for uh, a Durham region resident, I think there is a great security in knowing that if you had a child or one of your family members had a child or your neighbor had a child where they had multiple complex problems, that there's a place for that child right here in our community. And that's both in terms of the safety around the medical care, but just that feeling of belonging that I think Grandview really brings to the table and has sort of partnered with sick kids to bring in those experts that they really need and access to surgeries and specialized medical procedures but do whatever we can here and to try to improve quality of life and just normalize you know making every day a little bit better is really the goal and we know that we can't fix or change the underlying medical issue that's there but we certainly can help the families get through every day and make sure it goes as smoothly as it possibly can. And that wasn't possible before we had this, this clinic all here together. It was very fragmented, difficult care for families and you know we're just so glad we were able to start this. So the future for the complex program here in Durham, it looks really bright. We're two years into it now um, and I think there's only room to expand. We have about 50 kids in the program now and we've reached our capacity. So the future really looks at finding capacity to see more kids. We know that there's more kids in Durham that could benefit from this integrated care model and having everything come together for them. So getting that type of support to continue the program. You know, specifically for Grandview, the future is looking at our new site and finding a space that really uh, celebrates these kids, celebrates their lives, celebrates what they need for care and gives them a space that they can feel comfortable and happy and safe in for their medical needs, but also to find that community.